What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to Skull Ralphie, and I don't know when I'm uploading this. It's supposed to be Friday the 13th, 2018, here in all over the world, but it's 4 o'clock here, 6 o'clock p.m. here. Uh, in Chad, Africa. In Africa, Chad, Jamina, Jamina, whatever, can't say it. And D. Jamina. But I have no internet. The reason that's why I say I don't know I'm uploading it, because the internet's down right now. I don't know if you can hear the rain outside. It's raining really horribly. I've been in the room all day and like probably most of the day yesterday I worked only till 12 and then got home and probably at one and been in the room all day. I've been babysitting the same two cigars. I got two that look the same because I can't, it's hard to get them here, cigars. So I kind of smoke them really slow, you know what I mean? It's really slow. And now I got a stomach virus. I got something. Something. The guys at work have gotten sick uh, first, you know, and I cook all my food here. You know, you can hear that ring shit. I cook all my food in the room. You know what I mean? I got a kitchen over here. Um, you can see it in one of my videos. Uh, and I cook everything here, but, you know, it's because you, you, you got to be careful when you travel. Um, any country you travel to, any country, not just, you know, if it's like a third world, especially a third world, you know, countries that aren't that, you know, developed, whatever that, you know, maybe still, you know, um, you, uh, you know, third world or however you want to call them. You got to be careful, especially when you're, you know, coming from like America or something like that. Um, like even me, I'm Dominican, going to Dominican Republic, you know. There's certain things that I just can't eat, even though I am Dominican, I was born there, but my body got used to the food in the United States. And yes, that fly has been flying around for about, I don't know, I don't know how long they lived, but that thing has been, has outlived his life. And he's been flying around, he or she has been flying around here, unwilling to die. But I'm going to take care of that later. You see her right there? Where is she? Right here? Wherever. Anyway, so, yeah, it's just certain things you don't need. Like I said, I can't eat certain things. They will do certain things. Um, to make it play, like the water, you got to be very careful with the water. Uh, hell, in Florida, you don't drink the faucet, the water from the faucet, but you get a filter, and you know, filter. I got a filter here too, but I normally buy, you know, this like, bottled water. So they, they sell that everywhere because it's normal to drink bottled water here. Um, the meat. I got it at, um, I got it at, uh, this, like I said before, in the other, if you follow my other video, got a modern market, it's called modern market. All their stuff is imported from, uh, France and they got France, Brazil, and like maybe Italy or something like that. And some American stuff here and there, they got Ben and Jerry's, um, but uh, I bought a steak that was like vacuum sealed. It wasn't the best. <laughs> it looked good when I made it. I seasoned it. I only got, I got curry. I got, uh, I got uh, garlic powder. I got salt, pepper, basil, and parsley for some reason. I don't know. But I got those for free. So that's all the seasoning I have. So I've been seasoning everything with that. I bought some ramen. They're not called ramen, something else, it's the same thing, ramen. Um, I made me a soup yesterday. That helped a little, but it wasn't, you know. I put, I threw some chicken breast in there that I bought. The chicken was good, it was pretty, fairly decent. Things from Brazil. Um, you know, uh, you gotta be careful what you eat. Like, if you do, I ate, and, uh, you know, as I'm saying all this, uh, I got a counter story to that because I got sick eating the stuff. I don't know, and I'm not gonna blame the modern market for it. There's meat there. I'm not gonna say it was that. I guess it was just my turn because everybody else got sick here. Like it turns, one got sick, then the other one, then the other one, the other one, and it's like two days of hell. Mine isn't that bad because I was taking antibiotics before I got sick, fortunately, and I got some antibiotics that one of my buddies gave me. But um, I ate at a local restaurant I was invited to and I ate a burger and I'm pretty sure I'm 
I don't say 100%. I don't want to ask the guy who invited me because I'm not going to insult anybody. You know, I job thing. Uh, I'm pretty sure it was camel that was eating. Um, and it wasn't beef. Uh, and um, nothing happened. I was fine. I mean, it just, the taste was different. I was like, this is, this is different. You know what I mean? This is not a regular, regular burger. Uh, it was a good burger. The, when I ordered it, it was a double oh man double stacked burger like two meats i was like oh my god i only want one because i don't know what kind of meat this is but they brought me the two with an egg you know all the fillings their, their ketchup tastes different too um they brought me uh i got the uh what you call it the fries and all that stuff but i'm starving right now but everything i eat comes right back out so i'm kind of hanging in there you know uh Hopefully this goes away tomorrow so I can eat something, you know, so instead of eating freaking soup, you know what I mean? I'm tired of eating soup. Um, I need something, you know. I've been drinking water because you gotta stay hydrated. Because if not, uh, you know, you're gonna dehydrate fast. You know, you go in the bathroom, you know what I mean? And, uh, and you're throwing up, you know, you're losing all kinds of fluid. So still trying to smoke my cigar but as you can hear i don't know if you can hear that the it's i can't even go to the balcony because the balcony is probably a pool right now so there goes that idea you know what i mean so but other than that man other than the virus in my stomach <laughs> everything's everything's been pretty good man. everything's been pretty good you know? Uh, when my other co-worker gets it, he's a cigar smoker. He brings like a lot. That's what I've been told. He has a lot of cigars. And I told him, look, man, I'll give you $200, $300, whatever. Just bring me cigars. I don't even care at this point what he brings. I just haven't sat there and relaxed and smoked a cigar in so long that I'm going through drugs. Not that I'm addicted to it. It's just I'm addicted to the to the the, the leisure. I'm I'm addicted to the you know the relaxation that I get, the feeling of relaxation that I get from smoking cigars. So, and like I said, I have no internet, so my internet's down. You see my Wi-Fi thing there? Oh, you can't see it. It's all shiny, but you no. Know, anyway, but. Yeah. And I'm waiting. It's funny because I'm waiting for a call. I'm waiting for a call. I'm waiting for an email. And of course, this one decides to go down. But, so I can't really do anything. Watch movies, anything like that, right? So, so I make this video and I'll upload it whenever I can. So, anyway, don't forget to like and subscribe, man. Follow me on social media. Everything's on the links below. And I'll see you on the next smoke.